Um, presenting the Armenian case. Oh, this is wonderful. The Armenian case was presented in 1919 to the U.S. Senate. A special committee was put together on foreign relations of the U.S. Senate. I go over the, the, the uh, I actually got the whole transcript, and the whole transcript is in the appendix. So like 100 pages okay, of, of small print, basically, 10-point print. And the Armenians went, and you will read the names of all of the big shots that we had. Ottoman Garo, for instance, generals, I don't know, everybody, all the important Armenians. And this was going on, actually, during the uh, ARFs, the Armenian Revolutionary Federation's Ninth General Assembly. And when we get to the Ninth General Assembly, I'm going to have my mom do a little reading because this is a short chapter. You need to hear this. But anyway, presenting the Armenian case is um, Armenians going and basically telling the U.S. Senate what we have and what we can offer to the world and please help us. And in the end, they basically asked, allow us to take 40,000 volunteers that had served in World War I over to Armenia. We've been awarded this land to defend our borders and just give us some training, maybe a little bit of arms. We're not asking for much and we'll become good trading partners because we have gold, we have this. And you remember I mentioned oil in the title? Armenia at that time had one-sixth of the accessible oil in the world and the United States thought they were running out because they were the biggest suppliers of oil and so there's articles in there about that how America is, is losing you know losing ground they don't have oil Armenia has one-sixth of the oil and that deal Armenians were trying to push that so it's all in this thing presenting it to the Senate of what had what we had there's a list of the agricultural output, there's like there's charts and diagrams and all sorts of stuff. Basically, Armenians told the U.S., hey, we're like the richest, most wealthiest, mineral-wise, agricultural-wise country in the world. Help us, and we'll help you. Well, the U.S. didn't do that. That was October of 1919. started in September to October. They gave an answer finally in May of 1920, which was, sorry, we're just going to stay out of this. You know, we don't want to make Turkey mad. We don't want to do whatever. So that's where our that's where America's real first betrayal that was very noticeable. Of course, nobody talks about this because nobody knows. But now you know. Okay, so that was presenting the Armenian case. The one man Armenian.